hair's not greasy, it's just wet. Welcome back to Sims Plebs. The last episode I recorded was in February. <laughs> it is now July. So things went well for me. Mind you, I did have a breakdown a couple of months ago. I also haven't actually downloaded the software for this headset. It's meant to light up here. I was trying to figure it out earlier, but I got bored and couldn't be bothered to figure it out and I needed to record videos and edit videos and do all this other stuff. Today's mission in The Sims is to bring Strider back to life. <laughs> because tragically, last episode, he died. So there are a few ways we're going to try it today. We're going to try the wishing well. We're going to try the ambrosia. And we also have to try and get Strider to come back as a ghost first so that we can resurrect him. I would do the Book of Life one, but that would take a long time to get the aspiration to its full extent and master writing and planes go away. This is going to be a fun episode. No face cam because this is probably going to take me a long time to try and get him back to life. So this is what you're going to see of me. For now. My ears hurt. There's water in them. Okay, before we start, I just want to let you know I did buy a couple new packs when they're on sale. I got Outdoor Retreat, um, movie stuff, romantic garden stuff, and I got one more thing that I cannot remember. Patio stuff? Yeah. Um, I will be buying Island Living at some point. I just don't have the money at this particular moment. What what are you still doing here, huh? Why are you still here? Because <laughs> I left the game when Strider died. <laughs> have you noticed how nice the graphics are today? The clothes don't... Okay, they still look kind of painted on. Because I have a graphics card now, so everyone looks cool. Here we go. Yeah, pink one. <laughs> Just that one will do. Okay, I don't know if we have to wait for Strider to come back as a ghost first and invite him into our household. So we're gonna go talk to death. <laughs> Not the death we know and see what we can do. Maybe if we become friends with death. Hey, can you bring my friend back from the dead? <laughs> Let's come back. Is death sleeping in Z's bed? God damn it. I know everyone's sad. Why oh, see you trying to get in bed with me? Oh, Jesus. Steph's still here. Oh my god, he's watching our TV. Get out. Don't turn on my TV. I don't know how to get death out of my house. Do I have to unlock the door? I swear he can go through doors though. He's like, some paranormal shit is going on here. I guess we just have to wait for him to fuck off. Oh, Vlad, we don't have time for you. So we have Death watching our TV, and we have Vlad outside our door. Great day. Strider, Strider, come out, come out wherever you are. I'm not allowed to stop recording until we bring you back in the series. Let's see. You can have a day off. God damn it, Dom, stop having baths. Washing me in my clothes. I'm washing me in my clothes. I'm washing me in my she clothes. She drunk as fuck, bitch. I'm washing me in my clothes. <laughs> Wait till you see the. F <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> it's a good thing he was wearing clothes, wasn't it? I feel like it would be best for Dom to try the wishing well thing, since he was um 
had the most friendship with Strato. I may have to use some cheats. We'll try the wishing well thing first, because I know if you can't bring him back from the dead, you can get ambrosia from that. I don't know. Make a wish. Nope. Make an offering. Do 5,000. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Jesus. A highly generous offering. The Whispering Well is most pleased and will certainly grant a wish as well. Oh, what wish do I need? I need Strider to do it? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, so I have to make them live until... Make them live? Make them go through until Strider comes back as a ghost. Okay, looks like we've got to do some work. No, no, death, 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 death. Didn't it work? Why did that not work? Use a cheat on the cooking skill. <laughs> God damn it, Strider, show up. I need an angel fish, a potion of youth, and a death flower. Oh dear God. I'm gonna have to grind if I want to bring Strider back to life. Do you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna cheat the system. <laughs> Households. Edit. a little bit but I didn't have the time to do all the things all the things and wait for him to come back to life you know that would have taken freaking forever so we're just gonna cheat make everyone happy again and get on with our lives <laughs> why you sad cherish him mainly himself everything's fine we're all back together <laughs> to work on Strider's career a little bit though He's awake. Don't cry, he's right here. Did she draw? Oh my god, that's so sad. You see, the smart thing to do would be to end the episode here, but I ain't smart. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Dad. <laughs> yeah, Dom, you stink. I just became a notable newcomer. Oh, we need to pick a thing first, don't we? Oh, will do that one. So, yeah. We brought Strider back from the dead, albeit in a cheaty way. But we did it, and he's back. <laughs> I 
still love the comment I got last episode. <laughs> yeah, yeet, Strider fell to his feet. <laughs> Thanks for watching this episode. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends. Subscribe to see the next episode of Sims Plebs and more Minecraft stuff and SCP stuff and la da 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 da. I do a lot of gaming videos these days. <laughs> it's just because I love gaming so much at the moment. Uh, follow my social media, join the Discord, follow everyone else who is in this series Strider, Dom, Z, and Death. And I shall see you guys next time. A Janet. <laughs> He looks so happy about being alive again and Dom's just like, where's Strider? I don't know where he is. I don't know where Strider is. Okay, so I know this has no part in my video, but I just wanted to pay my respects to Cameron Boyce, who died on July 6th. He was a massive part of my childhood when I was growing up in shows like Jesse and being in Descendants and it was heartbreaking to learn that he died, especially when he was the exact same age as me and just knowing that you could go to sleep and never wake up again is just a terrifying thought really. But I just wanted to pay my respects and to tell all of you to tell people that you love them and to just, you know, take good care of yourself and your life and just make sure you let people know your feelings because you never know what might happen when you wake up the next morning.